Hi guys, welcome back, Tony CW here. We're on Roblox Islands today for their latest update. Now, before we get into the update, I just want to say thank you very much for helping me hit my 1,000 uh, subscriber goal. Um, I have set my next subscriber goal to 5,000, so hopefully I will get there uh, pretty soon. Um, but first of all, if you're not subscribed to the channel or new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button, it would really mean the world to me. Please turn on the post notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my video uploads. Please feel free to leave a comment in the section down below as I do respond to all comments left. And if you do like the video, please smash that like button and give this video a thumbs up. Okay guys, so before we actually get into the video, I just want to show you what's been released on the website. So I'll be right back guys. Okay guys, so as you can see it says here, update log September 6th, uh, they've released Fireflies, that's what the update is, so Islands Fireflies, Fireflies now appear during night time, rare chance for a rainbow firefly night event, we've got a net tool to catch the bees and fireflies, oh you, oh, you can actually catch bees as well, uh, display case block to show off your insect that you've caught, small and large variants, worker block, campfire, furnace etc now have progress bars, interesting. Added a quick collect shortcut to worker blocks, industrial smelter and sawmill effects overhaul. Okay. Um, they've redesigned the chest model and added animations, and they've added a new light source block to the lighting station, which is a game pass along with some new uh, free on something. Uh, they've actually cut the rest off, so <laughs> never mind. Okay, guys. So we'll get straight back into the game. Okay guys, so we're back in the game. So it did say that they've added some new light source blocks to the lighting station. Um, so if we have a look in here. Okay, so yeah. So we've got a firefly wall lamp. It requires one yellow, five, one yellow firefly jar and ten iron ingots. Then we've got a firefly garden light. Yeah, uh, again, yellow firefly jar and 25 wood this time. Okay, so let's have a look down here in the workbench, see if there's anything. Okay, so okay, so we've got a large display case there. So I'm going to make one of them. Uh, okay, so we've got a knit there. Uh, firefly lantern. Again, we need a yellow firefly jar and 25 stone this time. Um, okay, so I can't make that yet because I need that. Uh, doo -doo -doo, uh, okay, and then a small display case there, which is five glass and fifteen wood. Uh, anything else? Cooking table. Mm. Okay, so there's nothing else in here. I can't. Okay, so I can't see. I can't find anything in here for a yellow firefly jar. Okay, I'm wondering when we catch the net if it or if um you automatically put the stuff into a jar. Okay, so I'm not sure how that if that will work, but what we'll do, we'll just put these down for the time being. Um and then we can have our display cases side by side. Now it did say that the fireflies will um spawn at night, but Oh, okay. Oh, he goes in first person. Ah, oh, I like that. Okay, uh, let's try it. Can I? Hey, I could be. Ah, yeah, cool. Okay. So it does. It puts it straight into a jar. Hey, I like that. Um, now, what happens if I press? Oh no. Okay. Uh, when you catch it, it doesn't look like you can um, uh, empty it. But you can ah okay. Um, how, how do I put it in there? That's the question. Uh, okay, so I'm not sure how we put that in there at the moment. Um, and where is it? <laughs> Uh, right, just let me find this jar. There it is. 
Okay, so we've got to be in the jar. How do you... Okay, I, I'm not sure if you can actually put a B in there for the time being. So we'll have to have a look at that in a second. Okay, so um, it did say that the industrial smelter and the sawmill effects have had a uh, an overall. So let's go into my factory and have a quick look. Um, okay, so this that's my sawmill. Okay, so if I just put some wood in there and then just put that in there. So so we've got a progress bar here showing obviously how long it's going to be before it's done. We've got the progress bar there. Okay, so there's something going on in the little window. Um, apart from that, I can't... Oops, Apart from that, I can't see anything major that has actually been done to the sawmill. Um, but I have actually got my smelter up the top here. So we'll quickly go up the top here. Being that my smelter is actually uh, throwing it all down into here. And then let's have a look. Okay, so the, s the smelters have actually got these new things on the side, some cogs. Um, let's put these in and then some coal and sit. Okay, that's cool. I oh, okay, so they're, they're restarting the server again. Okay, so I'm just going to pause the video while it re reloads into the server and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so we're back in the game since they updated it. Um, now, as you seen before, they did update the um, smelters. have got some cogs on the side, so when they actually have the ore and the coal in there smelting, the cogs turn and a little bar goes up and down. Now, I do just want to actually pull in the Discord from Islands just to show you the rest of the stuff that's not actually um, on the website. So I'm just going to pull that in and show you. <coughs> so as you can see, uh, we got all the way down to this one here where it said adding new light source blocks to light station along with some new free ones. But then we've got these that wasn't on the web page. So it says here added light source blocks that can be coloured using caught fireflies. So that looks like it's uh, a nice little effect. They've added special music while you're in combat now, and they are going to be putting, putting more atmospheric music soon. They've added a blueprint learn effect, uh, fixed an issue that caused interaction to break on mobile, fixed several inventory issues on Xbox. They fixed a bug that caused worker block production to only take five seconds. Uh, they'll keep an eye on it to make sure timers aren't too long. Uh, rewrote the entire interact system um, and changed the way factories handle physics to improve server performance. Okay, so that's obviously the rest of the stuff that was on the Discord that wasn't on the web page. Now, I'm still not sure how we put the bees in here. Um, I think it might only be. Um, for the fireflies, so we'll have to wait till night. Hopefully, fireflies will um, pop up, and then we can catch them. Now, I'm just checking it again, just in case the update that they just done actually added anything else. Okay, so now they haven't added anything else. Now, I'm wondering if they've actually done any more to that building that they was actually building in the main island so okay yeah so they, they have actually done a little bit more to this you've actually got the roof on now um, and you've obviously got more logs that have been taken off to represent that they're actually building whatever it is here um, hopefully it's a new shop 
hopefully they bring out say a gold totem or some new type of ore totem that we can actually buy and put in our island which will help us get more stuff a lot quicker so I am hoping that the sun goes down shortly wherever oh, there it is okay so the sun is going down slowly um, but it's going down a little bit slower than expected but I still would like to know it, it does say on the website that these are for all the insects that you caught now I thought you'd be able to put bees in there but at the moment it's not letting you um, I don't know why I'm trying to click in there and it won't have it okay so let me just get my uh, net out again okay so the sun is slowly going down oh okay that was a bit I had uh, some lines in here um, it did say that they've actually changed some of the chests oh okay um, they've actually changed the small chests um, so that's Oh, I do like that. The actual lid opens up and opens and closes. Oh, that is cool. That is. Um, yeah, look at that. <laughs> I like it. Um, right, have they actually done anything with the medium chests? Let's have a look. So, okay, now so they haven't they haven't done anything with the medium chest. It's on the uh, wooden chest that they've actually done. So we've got the we've got the new animation with the small wooden chests. The medium chests are still the same. Um, the sun is still going down, so hopefully that will go down pretty soon. Now, as you can see on here, I've actually got three beehives at the moment collecting uh, honey. This was from the previous update. Now I have managed to collect a little bit, but I have noticed even though I've got three hives, um, ah, okay, that wasn't that wasn't well, yeah, still won't let me uh, collect from it because the bees, are, even though the bees have come with this hive, the bees are actually going to these hives here. So if the hives are too close, I think the bees just go to the hives that are closest by as, as you can see that bee that came over here which should be with this one um, is actually running there I've not collected anything from this bee hive at present so if I, I think if I wanted I could actually break that tree and have that hopefully spawn somewhere else um, but I've put a lot of flowers on my island to try and get more bees but I've only managed to get three hives at the moment a lot of people have said that they've actually got up to about eight hives, but I'm pretty sure that on the Discord and on the Twitter, um, it does say that you can actually only get up to four hives. So I'm not certain if that's correct, what people are saying that they gain eight hives when it says that you can only get four. So as you can see, the sun is getting quite low. So hopefully that will get even lower pretty soon so fingers crossed I want to I want to try and get some of these fireflies um, actually spawning on my island because um, I want to see what they look like and obviously I want to see if I can put them in there and being that the bee went straight into a jar I'm wondering that being that we need the yellow firefly jar there if we get different coloured fireflies then obviously whatever we catch will go into the jar and that's how we get the yellow firefly so the sun is going down gradually and slowly <laughs> as you can see there's a, a bit of a shadow coming on my island now which is a good thing so fingers crossed that will actually drop and go further down now <coughs> excuse me I am looking at probably 
restarting my island. Um, so on one of my next videos, if I've restarted my island, you might see that all this may have gone, or I may have started de uh, destroying stuff. Um, but I'm just wondering on what I want to build at the moment. So hopefully, if I do restart my island, you'll see a new build. Um, obviously, on newer videos. Okay, so the sun is actually getting down. I'm getting my net ready, and hopefully these fireflies will spawn. Okay, so there you go. So the sun's down completely now. Now it's just a matter of going around seeing where these fireflies are so all my bees okay so some of my bees are still collecting so it's not fully night time yet because when it is night time these bees actually go to sleep so let's have a look at this uh, are they okay so he's gone to sleep he's gone to sleep now so it's fully night time now. ah there we go hey I've got one yellow firefly hey oh this is cool hey don't go away come here there we go okay so I've got three so far oh what's this that green one It. Why can't I catch it? Ah, oh, come off here. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, so I've got a green firefly. Got another yellow one. Oh, th this is cool, actually. Okay, so I've got all the ones that are up here, I think. Uh, do do do. I know there's one over there, hiding in the corner. Come here. Gotcha. Okay, so I've actually caught all those fireflies. Um, any more hiding around? There we go. There's one. Okay, so that's another one. Um. Ah, there's one over there. Oh, there's a red one as well. Hey, we've got so we've got a red, a yellow, and a green. Um, so they don't necessarily stay on the grass. They can actually go onto the um, concrete as well. Ah, look, there's one up there. Oh, the the cheeky little sod. The cheeky. The cheeky one's actually up there. I can't get up there. Not unless I build anyway. Um, any more around? Uh, okay, let's check my onion farm. See if there's any hiding around here. Oh, no, I thought I seen one there. No. Okay, so that one, that one there. He's being a bit cheeky and actually uh, hiding up the top. So I can't get that. There's another one that's spawned here. So, there we go. I'm just trying to get as many as I can so I can actually make the stuff to show you guys. Oh, there we go. Come here. There we go. I don't want to catch the bee, so... Oh, don't catch the bee. Don't catch the bee. There we go. And we've got another red one here. Come here. There we go. Uh, oh, the bees are starting to wake up. So, oh, look at that one over there. Oh, he's gone. Okay, so I managed to get a few before the sun come up. Um, so that was actually pretty decent. Um, so as you can see, I've managed to get ten yellow and one green, um, and I did get a couple of red, which should be here. There we go. Now, 
Moment of truth. Hey, there we go. Okay, so put one of them in there. Put one of them in there. Put one of them in there. Hey, there we go. So as you can see, I've actually got three different coloured flyer flies in there now. So I've got a green, a red, and a blue in there. So I've kept some of the yellows because I want to actually make some of these. So I'm going to make one of them. Uh, one of them. Let's go down here and make the. Where are you? Firefly lantern. And I think that was it. Okay, so I've made those now. So let's go and put these down and actually have a look at what these look like. Okay, so I'll put them in there now. I've just got to find all the stuff in here. There's Firefly Lantern, that's the Firefly Wall Lamp. Uh, what else was it? What else was it? Uh, where are you? Um, do, 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 do. I've lost it. I've lost it. Where are you? Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, okay, what was it that I made? Ah, the Firefly Garden Light. Okay, so it's a small little, uh, small little thing, so it's easy to miss. There we go. Oh, look, look how small that is. No, no wonder I missed it. <laughs> okay, so let's put these down. So we've got a Firefly Garden lamp. Oh, that, that looks. They actually look pretty cool actually. Okay, so a firefly wall lamp. So obviously you're only gonna be able to put it on the wall. But to be honest, that's actually got some that's got quite a bit of a light range there has. Because if you look at that and then go on the wall, it it's got some range. Okay, so you got the light up and down, and then we've got the firefly lantern. So, to be honest, that actually looks quite cool. I might actually replace these lanterns with these ones because that actually, that that looks like they they are designed to actually go on top of the um, the picket fences, where these they look like they're just sat on. These look like they've actually been screwed on. So I do actually like the new ones. That is that's pretty good actually. So I, I am going to be collecting a lot more fireflies and actually making a lot more of them. And as you can see, that actually stands out a lot more. So even in the daytime, it's still lit up. Um, in the night, obviously, this should actually light up quite a lot. But I do like that as well. Um, so I'm gonna, I am going to catch quite a few more of them. So I do like it. But the one thing I do like about the net as well is the actual animation. That's I, I, li I like how you actually grab it. That's cool. Oh, I didn't mean that. Okay, so um, what else was there? Um, it did say that there was a rare chance for a rainbow firefly uh, night event. Now, I'm not sure if that rainbow event meant the different colours, being that I've got a red, yellow and green, or if there's going to be other colours. So if there, if there, are, if there are more colours, I will show you obviously in a later video. But as you, see, as you can see, there is a red, yellow, and green that I've managed to catch at the moment. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Now, it, it did say that they've actually done some modification to some of the blocks, but I can't actually see what they've done to the blocks. I can see, I can see that they've uh, changed the actual layout of the small chest in here as well to the new style. So I do like that. Um, I do still like the honeycomb block because um, because that does actually look a little bit like lava. Um, so I might actually make some of these, and I might do some sort of a volcano area on my island and use this as a lava. So hopefully I'll be able to show you that in a later video. Um, but it looks like that's everything that they've actually released in. Um, in the game 
Now, I do want to give a shout out to um, Alpha CWX and Archie Jack Sparrow 8. Um, I have actually joined um, Alpha CWX's private server um, because the update got released on private servers before the public servers. Uh, so he was kind enough to let me join his server. Um, so thank you very much for that. Um, but apart from obviously the stuff that they've released in the update, um, I can't see anything else. But I do actually like how they've done it, and I do like that they keep, that they keep adding new stuff in the game, especially new um, insects and that. Uh, first was obviously the bees, which was a nice added effect, especially if we can actually get honeycomb to make all those new stuff. And now to have fireflies to make the firefly lanterns and torches and that, I do like what they're doing. Um, so, what I would actually like to see in future video, uh, so future updates, I don't know if they will do it, but being that they've actually made these large cases for putting the fireflies in. I'd like to see them incorporate more insects, um, maybe ants um, or something like that, and then you can actually do a um, like an ant farm and have all ants going through um, little areas of the dirt, and you can actually see them walking through the dirt. So as I was saying, if they, if they do release anything like uh, ants, we can obviously have an ant farm, being that they've got these display cases. So they can actually make uh, the display cases with uh, like imitation dirt in there with little um, like tunnels as you would see in an ant farm. And then when you put the ants in there, they could be animated to walk um, in through the tunnels. So that would actually be a nice uh, bit of an effect. Um, hopefully they don't release, uh, release spiders. Um, I'm not really a fan of spiders. Um, I don't mind them, but I don't think I'd like to see the spiders running around on my island. Um, especially if uh, they actually made it where they made webs and you had to clean your island um, and get rid of them. I think that might be a bit of a pain, so hopefully they don't re uh, release uh, spiders. But, as I said, if they do release uh, ants, that would be a nice addition, as well as some more insects. Being that we've got these fireflies, they could also release um, like dragonflies um, and have obviously dragonflies flying around um, our island. And being that they are dragonflies, they can actually be out during the day and the night, so that would be a nice uh, addition to the game as well. Okay, guys, so as for this update, um, I've shown you everything that has been released. I've shown you the new stuff that is in the loading station that if you've got the game pass you can make. Uh, if not, I dare say you will see a lot of these in vending machines very soon. You've got the large display case, the small display case, you've got the net. Uh, obviously you can catch bees but you can't put the bees in here, unfortunately. Um, so I don't know I don't know why they've made made it where you can catch a bee being that you can't put it in there. I think it's a little bit pointless at the moment, so hopefully they do include that into the um, the display cases. Um, I've showed you the other stuff that they've released, which is um, the lantern, as I said. I've showed you the new animation on the smelter. I didn't see it. I didn't see any new animation on the sawmill except for the little sparks inside. Um, I don't remember seeing them originally, so I think it's just the sparks inside that they've done. I do like how they've actually put a progress bar on the um, on the actual smelters now and the sawmills, so you can actually see how long it's going to take for them to uh, obviously change the wood into wood planks or smelt the ore into iron ingots. So I do like how they've done that. But for now guys, that's obviously everything for this update. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, please smash that like button. Uh, see if we can actually get um, 
about 200 likes on this video um, once again I do want to say thank you very much for all my supporters and uh, subscribers help me to get my first milestone of a thousand subscribers I really really appreciate that and I really appreciate your support so thank you very much for that um, as I said my next goal will be 5,000 subs um, when I do hit 5,000 subs I will actually do a face reveal um, a lot of my subs have asked me if I can do one and I have said to them that when I do hit the 5,000 subs I will do a face reveal um, but until that time i hope you've enjoyed this video and i will catch you in the next video stay safe guys and peace out